welcome to today's, well, tonight's review. It's not daytime anymore, as in my previous review, and which I am dubbing the post St. Patrick's Day review. Why is it post St. Patrick's Day? Because after I did that Killian's Lair's right, I decided to go and polish off the rest of that sir, as well as go and sample the gin I bought. Uh, in short, considering it was a work night, it was not my best decision. Uh, <laughs> so, I am not going to be doing an alcohol review tonight. I am going to be doing another shrub review. So, what's a shrub you may be, may be asking? Well, go and look at my previous shrub review. Um, I'm kind of likely to be doing a lot more non-alcoholic beverage reviews. I don't know, maybe kombucha, maybe root beer, maybe like some craft sodas. It's, it's just something I haven't explored much. There's a couple things I kind of want to review beforehand. But I need to give my liver a rest. So, and what I'm reviewing tonight is really good. Because what is it? Well, it's Kaimuki Super Red. So the same brand I went and bought last time uh, from a restaurant that my friend is manager of. Uh, and this one is Local Orange and Olena Shrub. So, ingredients are local oranges, sugar, rice vinegar, and Olena. What is Olena? Uh, Olena is Hawaiian turmeric. Not a, uh, it's not an endemic plant, it's actually found throughout the Pacific and Asia. Um, so if you know turmeric, turmeric is sort of a root. Uh, it has a sort of bright orange or yellow dye, it's what um, they use it in Asia to dye things. And it's also quite good for cleaning the liver, which is uh, I kind of need right now. So, let's have at it, shall we? Now local oranges. They're not like Florida oranges, they're kind of smaller, they look more like tangerines, and um, depending on the weather, they can either be kind of tartar than your average orange, or sweeter than your average orange. Tend to be a run on a little bit on the seedy side too, so uh, you know, you kind of have to pick a lot of seeds out of them. But in this case, we don't really have to worry about it, because um, seed picking has already been done for us. So, I'm going to pour out some shrub here. And let's do a preliminary smell. Very fruity, kind of vinegary. Very much sweet orange essence in there. And a bit of floralness too. Now let's go and add soda water. Uh, brings up the floral side a little bit more. Interestingly, not much uh, earthy taste from the Elena. Um, when I've had it before in other cooking applications, it imparted a slight earthiness and a slight spiciness, which I'm not really getting. It's pretty much um, floral, oranges, orange blossom. Nicely sweet and refreshing. <clears throat> Not as tart as the grapefruit shrub, um, but of course, local oranges are a lot more sweet than grapefruits. All in all, another great shrub. I'm going to be looking forward to trying other brands of shrub, that's vinegarated drinks, as well as, um, you know, other things, you know, for a nice maybe month-long sort of liver rehab that I need to do. And, um, you know, something like, I'm going to be doing more reviews along this line of thought. Um, so what would I mix this with? Definitely gin. It would go well with gin. Which is why I picked up a bottle of gin. 
I'm not going to be having it tonight because I drank too much last night. But uh, in, a, in my next review, I might do a little bit of a cocktail mixing. See how that turns out, eh? Well, that's your shrub review for tonight. Cheers. And I hope you're ho doing better than I am. <laughs> Not nursing a hangover after a 12-hour shift. That's all, folks.